Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Easter weekend, it's Good Friday today. And today is the first day of the Mariners season. I don't know, it's the Seattle baseball team. So I don't know nothing about baseball, I know nothing about sports, but we're going. I think it's called opening day, I don't know. So I thought we'd do like a quick catch up. I feel like my last video, I didn't talk much. So I just got back from Vegas. Okay, I'm just gonna be talking to you while I do my makeup because I have to leave in about an hour. So I'll just prep my skin real quick. Nothing new here, except that I'm trying out this new Dior foundation that I actually bought, but I just have a sample size over here from Sephora. Oh my God, I don't have a beer again. Oh my God, I didn't put sunscreen again. I think it's too late. Let's just put on sunscreen. I'm using the Elta MD Sport one. This is gonna be the first baseball game that I've ever been to. <gasps> oh, I think I put too much. <laughs> oh no. But this does blend out. <laughs> I look so funny. I can't. I look like a ghost. I just put like one strip. They said to put two fingerfuls, but yeah, this is gonna be the first baseball game that I've ever been to. We're going with a few of our friends, our couple friends. So it's gonna be a triple date, to my knowledge. What else? I just finished up an appointment with a new doctor. She's a holistic practitioner. I don't, she's a naturopath? I think that's the term for it, but it's like a holistic type of doctor and she specializes in digestive health. I'm trying to make her my primary care doctor, but right now I'm trying to see her to help heal my gut and, okay, it's getting hot. See how that blended out? But yeah, she suggested a diet intervention is what she called it. And basically she's asking me to not eliminate, but try to avoid certain types of food and the list that she gave me is all my favorite foods she said spicy food chocolate pastries what was the other one that was pretty big coffee which i know that irritates my stomach but some things you can't remove from your diet you know this is the little foundation that i'll be using today but this is the dior backstage face and body but yeah, we'll see how we get along with that. I really wanted her to suggest like, uh, I don't know. I don't know if I could do it, guys. Gonna blend it in. It's just so natural. It's like a skin tint. Just makes you look so pretty. You're like so pretty. It has a pretty strong smell to it though. It's like kind of perfumey. Follow along. The coverage on this is pretty light, so I like to go in with a high coverage concealer. Today's a fingers kind of day. Using this Flower Beauty Day Glow. I'm gonna use it as a highlight. That's how it looks. Pretty. It's like a balmy consistency. Oh, look at my eyebrows. They're like pretty much gone now. Kind of sad. I have a touch up appointment next week, Sunday. And I hope it lasts this time. I don't know. Kula bronzer, nothing new here. Oh my gosh, I don't have my brushes next to me. So let's just use what came in here. Next, I'm gonna go in with my Tower 28 blush in. It's either Beach Please or Rush Hour, I'm not sure. I'm gonna use my fingers because I don't wanna get up and get my brushes. Ooh, that's a lot. I feel like that's a little bit heavy on the blush, but that's okay. I want to do the fluffy brow moment. Have my e.l.f. brow lift. And let's lift them brows, girl. I really was supposed to do this as a first step, but I forgot. How fun! I think my eyebrows turned out nice and fluffy. Oh, another update is I've been on a Mariah Carey kick. So like I've been playing her This Is Mariah Carey playlist on Spotify. It's been fun. But yeah, look at my eyebrow. Love how that turned out. It's like a very fluffy brow. Girl, we've come a long way. 
I know what else we could talk about. We could talk about Good Friday. Um, I remember as a kid, our grandma told us we could be loud. So like we had to be quiet the whole day. And as a kid, you're always screaming. So I don't know if that's a, an actual thing that you have to be quiet, but comment down below if you had any Good Friday traditions. I have this rash on my eye. It's just never ending, guys. It's what it feels like to be aging. Your body just starts deteriorating. <laughs> It's my half birthday like next week, the 26th. Isn't that exciting? Not really. It's kind of sad. Baby, it's a good So, this is the completed makeup look. I went with a long lasting lipstick because I think we're gonna eat fries. Apparently, there's like really good garlic fries. Um, my outfit is just a sweater and this bomber jacket. Look kind of boyish, but that's okay. Um, that's the vibe. See you maybe at the baseball game. The baseball game. goes up to the ninth inning. Yeah, I hope this is right, but her goes up to oh! Oh! Bomber is seven. What? Bomber is seven. <laughs> <laughs> stains on my jeans from that baseball game <laughs> that we went to and I've never used any of these things before like to take off like stains and stuff so it will either ruin my jeans or make it amazing I'm also gonna use this on my shoes that I wore to Vegas when I went on that hike wait I probably should read the directions first turn on cover stain and rub in wait one to five minutes and launder in warmest water okay Sounds easy enough. Ketchup stays be gone. So it's time to make lunch and I'm gonna make this egg dish using this just egg. And then I'm gonna have some of these stadium dogs. These are the best vegan hot dogs that I've had so far, but they're pretty pricey. This thing was, I think, $6.99 or $7.99, and it only comes with six, so it's a treat. But I love hot dogs, so let's get to cooking. So for the eggs, I'm just gonna add some garlic, onions, and tomatoes, and maybe some magic syrup, which is like a, a seasoning from the Philippines. It literally translates to magic Yum. Magic delicious, I think. <laughs> you could sprinkle it on anything and it makes it taste good, so. Cause I'm actually really hungry right now. It's already 12 and I usually eat at one. And I also came from Spin, so. You know, it's just been a busy morning. Oh, I also have my touch up appointment for my brows. So that means I can't work out for two weeks again after my Sunday appointment, so. 
we're gonna be doing things. I could put too much garlic, but how much garlic is too much garlic? Oh, and also happy belated Easter. You guys like my shirt? I thought it was fitting. My best friend got this for me and it says loved beyond measure. How was your Easter? Yesterday we just went to Matt's parents' house and we had a little barbecue. I had a burger and they had some sliders and we had fries and just hung out. And that was my weekend. Don't mind the washer dryer going off right now, but this is what it looks like. This is the vegan just egg and the stadium dogs. Ugh, yum. Where's my fork? <laughs> so excited. Now I'm gonna try using that shout on these. Here's the before. Let's see the after. Ta-da! No more ketchup stains, guys. And here's the after of the shoe. Looks pretty good, but obviously not as good as when I first got it. Like, it's a little bit yellowish at the top. And it missed a few spots, but this was like minimal effort, so looks good. 10 out of 10 recommend. Freaking adulting life hack. I also like to spray some of this heavy duty water repellent on my white shoes, or actually on any shoe. And that just helps to keep it cleaner for longer. But yeah, recommend. Received a cute package in the mail. I have an idea of what it is. Let's do a first impressions. I just got home from work. Ow, and my legs hurt. <laughs> Should we read the card first? Passport holder. Pink. Yeah. Passport holder. Sheesh. Ah. My gosh. She always spoils us. <sighs> Hungry. 